up, Luchi gang? Welcome back to our channel. You are watching Blue Channel TV. My name is Kelly Jean. And I'm Lucky Lou. If you haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Don't be a hater all your life, man. Make sure you subscribe right now. And also, make sure you stay true and hit the like button. Don't forget to turn on your post notifications. That way you get notified every time we post a new video. Right now, we're on our way to go mail this merch off to y'all. If you haven't already, go to LucianoTV.com and you can order you some merch. You know, we just got a shipment in we've been waiting on since it flooded in Houston and we just got it in. Actually, we got it in yesterday afternoon, but today we're mailing out y'all merch. So if you've been waiting for your merch, it is on the way. Trust me, it is on the way. So y'all look out for that. We got the Luciano TV shirts. We got the Don't Be A Hater All Your Life shirts. We got the uh, Player Made Stay True uh, shirts. So yeah, man, go to LucianoTV.com and copy your merch. And y'all stay on the lookout because we got a whole new gang of uh, winter season merch coming soon. So y'all stay tuned for that. y'all's merch make sure you go and click the link in the description right now bluechannel.tv.com to copy your merch i promise i will send it out the next day <laughs> hey hey if y'all come through saturday to the day of unity we're gonna have a little bit of merch on deck so if you run up on us you might be able to copy some merch personally from kelly jean or lucky lou we both gonna be in the building so come through this saturday 2800 navigation from 12 p.m. to 10 p.m. day of unity so with that being said we have to go run some more errands and i am starving we gotta guys. go eat that's all we gotta do is <laughs> i'm freaking starving <laughs> i'm so hungry now i have an excuse to be a little fatty like i am pregnant babe we're gonna get fat together baby don't worry about it uh i am so like happy now that i see that we have so much support you guys like it's not even i was like stressing out at first and i found out i was like oh my god oh my god oh my god oh my god but now i'm just kind of it's kind of sinking in like like i snapped out of my shock and i felt numb at, at first but slowly but surely i've been hearing from all my friends all of y'all on here commenting and just telling me congratulations and giving me words of encouragement and i just want to thank my lovely husband right here because i can be a hard a tough cookie at times and he never gives up on me he's always like babe i love you it's all gonna be all right and <laughs> And sometimes he does put me in my place, but sometimes we need that, ladies, so. All right, guys, so as Lucky is inside of a store real quick, um, I wanted to talk to y'all a little about, um, I keep, it feels weird saying it, but anyways, now that I am, now that I am pregnant, maybe this, it was the cause of my anxiety, but I will say I did deal with anxiety in the past. I have been dealing with anxiety, whether it was affected or triggered by the pregnancy and my hormones, I don't know, but I do know that I wanted to come and talk to y'all because I know that a lot of y'all could relate and shared y'all stories with me about y'all's anxiety experience and how y'all have felt everything that y'all have gone through dealing with anxiety so with that being said I wanted to encourage y'all to communicate express yourself don't keep it to yourself whatever you are going through whatever you are feeling whatever you are thinking a lot of times keeping it to yourself is affecting you more than you know more than you think um, I know that I told y'all in one of my previous vlogs that I have just been trying my best to express myself as much. I tell Lucky what's bothering me. I tell him what is on my mind. I tell him like everything that just runs through my mind that I just can't get it off my mind as much as you try to get it off your mind. Um, so express yourself, talk about it, um, let it out. 
voice your opinion on it even if you think that people are going to judge you or people are going to think you're crazy or people are going to think that you are being dramatic a lot of the times just by opening your mouth and speaking it letting it go is it has a huge impact on you and your anxiety and your body because honestly after i started expressing myself to him after i started like just crying to him and letting him know like look i don't even know why this is running through my mind i don't even know why i feel like this i don't even know why i'm thinking about this um but it's just always on my mind or like it just randomly comes to my mind and i can't get it out of my mind and i feel like this is what's giving me anxiety and i just wanted to talk to you about it and just by me doing that i realized a huge change in the way i felt the way my anxiety was affecting me like the knot in my throat the tension around my neck the headaches the mood swings the the confusion about why i'm feeling like this why am i thinking like this why this why that and again um, my pregnancy hormones might have been triggering it a lot so i do want to say that in my case that might be what was causing the huge tension um, and anxiety attacks but in your case it might be completely different i just really wanted to encourage y'all to express it express it let it go talk about it with somebody that's not gonna judge you with somebody that's actually gonna listen to you somebody that you know has a clear head and is mature enough to listen to you and also give you advice that you know is not gonna just make things worse so I wanted to give a huge shout out to Patricia for sharing her story with me and just making me feel completely normal for feeling the way I felt about being overwhelmed with my child uh, on the way and understanding where I was coming from with this anxiety. Lucky's about to get in the car, so my speech is coming to an end. <laughs> I just wanted to give y'all a huge shout out again for all the support. Has she been talking y'all head off? And really give y'all that advice to speak your mind. We are all grown here and, you know, you just have to release it. I ain't gonna lie, I want a sawgrass, but he pulled up to this. You said you wanted mashed potatoes. Home country cooking. Yeah, this homemade country cooking. They got chicken fried steak, mashed potatoes. And I ain't even mad at him, you guys. Like, we finna go in here. I've never been, so I'm excited because that's what I was craving. I was like, I could eat a whole bucket of buttery mashed potatoes right now. You said mashed potatoes? I said I got the perfect spot. Country cooking. See the sign right here? What it say? Country cooking. That's right. We about to eat. You guys, look, I want one of these outside my house. Oh, it's empty in here. We're gonna eat. We're gonna get seated and then we're gonna eat. Oh my goodness. Do y'all see this? Look at these mashed potatoes, that mac and cheese, and that chicken fried steak. Ain't no jack in the box burger. What's wrong? <laughs> Kelly over here cutting coupons. Okay. <laughs> she saw in the little paper there's a coupon. Ten dollars off. It was delicious. Now I'm about to just go home and lay down and take a nap. I'm super, 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 super sleepy, drained, and full. I still got a lot of work to do. That was just my lunch break. I gotta go drive all the way to the other side of town, run to the studio real quick. I'm busy during the day, man. Like yesterday, I went and shot a video. Shout out to my boy Charlie Brown. He came from Florida. And then today, I gotta go to the studio and then come back and edit this vlog and make sure I get it up in time for y'all. That's why the vlogs be going up kind of late lately because I be busy during the day. By the time I get home, then I got to edit the vlog and still try to put it up for y'all. It's hard work trying to 
still do my my day-to-day -day business and run a successful vlog channel for y'all but we getting it done know what i'm saying we're getting it done and speaking of that tomorrow's payday so if you want your hundred dollar cash giveaway if you did not know on luciano tv every friday we give away a hundred dollars we usually tell y'all to leave your cash app name in the comments but we're doing it a little bit different now we're asking y'all to leave y'all email address so we want you to go to luchigang.com luchigang.com and click enter to win that's all you got to do enter your email address and we're going to select one lucky winner every friday and once your email address is in there you don't got to keep entering your email address just do it one time so like before you were having to leave your cash app name over and over and over and over again you don't got to do that no more so now once you enter your email address your name's already going to be in there and every friday we're going to pick a winner so as soon as this video is over or just hit pause hit pause right now Beep. and go to luchigang.com and click enter to win once you enter your email address not only are you going to be qualified to win the hundred dollars every friday we give away but you'll also be part of the fam that way whenever we drop a new shirt a new hoodie a new hat a new video anything we'll send it to y'all and you'll be first to get notified when we have anything new coming out so go be part of the fam. If you part of the fam, part of the Lucci Gang, go to luchigang.com and click enter to win. We're trying to give y'all some money, man. We're trying to spread the wealth. You know what I'm saying? Your blessings ain't supposed to be just for you. you your blessings are made to share with other people. And that's what we're trying to do, man. We're trying to spread our love and share these blessings. So go to luchigang.com right now. Church. You be good. Come back home safe and sound to me, all right? All ready, baby. Take care of business, man. Take care of business. I'll be back with y'all in a minute. I'm gonna go run to the studio, handle some business, and be back. What's up, Filthy? How you living, man? What's going down, man? We living good, buddy. No, we come to the city, not got the damn shit. 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 Damn I do good business around here, man. I, I ain't even have to drop the verse. You know what I'm saying? My name's so good, I ain't even have to drop the verse. Boys well, know I'm good for it. You know what I'm saying? That's why you got to keep a good reputation out here, man. You got to keep a good name for yourself. You know what I'm saying? A good name, a good reputation will go a long way. You know what I'm saying? Don't dirty up your business. You know what I'm saying? Do good business with people, man. You got to do good business out here. And we A1 square wear straight across the board. I just made it home. I'm trying to figure out why Houston playing with a Minnie Mouse puzzle. She brought it to me, so I was like, let's do it. What are you doing, Houston? Look, say hi to Daddy. Woo! Yay! All right, man, before we get up out of here and uh, figure out what we're going to do for dinner, because it's about that time. We want to give some birthday shout outs and appreciate all y'all for tuning in. Don't forget, go to luchigang.com so you can enter to win this $100 giveaway tomorrow, Friday, and each and every other Friday. So, uh, our first birthday shout out goes to Mia Lehigh, turning 11 years old. Happy birthday, baby girl. Next birthday shout out goes to Viviana Quinones. Olivia Elias. Happy birthday to you from Garland, Texas. And then I have the very last birthday shout out for Kimberly, who is turning 15 today. Happy, happy birthday to all of y'all. And we appreciate all y'all for watching Luciano TV. Y'all stay tuned. And uh, don't forget, go to luchagang.com so you can enter to win this $100 giveaway. Yeah.